The wolf requests the presence of the mercenary. We shall be up to him in a moment. With respect, he wishes to see the mercenary alone. What? I said the commander I wishes... I heard what you said. I just don't understand why. Those were his orders, sir. Very well. It appears I have other matters to attend to. So you are the champion who won us today. Tell me your name, hero, so that I may greet you as a true warrior. Here, Pater. It's been a long time. Impossible. I saw you fall. I didn't fall. You fucking threw me to my death! I did what was required of me as a Spartan. I've made my peace with that. You need to as well. You are my father. You are supposed to protect me. You were reckless. You forced my hand. I was protecting my sister because you wouldn't! The Oracle decreed that Cassandra had to die. Her word is absolute. You know that. You can't cower behind your sense of duty anymore! Enough! I can't change the past, Alexios. I will live and die a Spartan. There's a large reward for the mercenary who can collect the wolf's head. Is that why you're here? Save you from a ghost of your past. Now you will answer to me. I am going to watch the light fade from your eyes as you die by my hand. I loved you. And your sister. You were never truly mine. What do you mean? There's something you need to ask your mother. Alexios. Alexios. Beware the snakes in the grass. What's the meaning of this? By all the gods! What have you done? I came here to get revenge against the man that tried to murder me. And that's what I did. Traitor! Have my 
my head for this. I need to get out of here. So, did you kill your father? Step, father. I suppose the gods won't judge you too harshly for a step patricide. Nikolaus raised me, trained me. He was my father, even if he did try to kill me. Is that better or worse? No matter. Yours isn't the only complicated family in the world. Thanks. I'm glad to have you around, Varnavas. I'm happy to be here. Would anything else help? Finding my mother. She's alive, Varnavas. At least, Nikolaus thought so. Some good news, praise Ida. What's your plan? What course should I set, Captain? For now, we go to Fukis. Elpinor said he'd meet me there. He owes me money. And an explanation. I, Alexios. And let's seek the wisdom of the Pythia while we're there. If anyone has answers for you, it's the Oracle of Delphi. The Oracle's predictions destroyed my family. The Pythia has the wisdom of Apollo himself. Now, I'll admit, if people choose to ignore her, they might court disaster. If we ignore the Pythia? My sister would still be alive, and our mother would be safe at home. Hmm. Back to business. You know where to meet Elpinor, I suppose? His home is in Pilgrim's Landing. But Nikolaus's last words to me were a warning of snakes in the grass. Sounds like you should make extra preparations. Elpinor is the one who should prepare. Meet me at Apollo's temple in Delphi when you're done dealing with the snakes. Pinor has a lot of explaining to do.
We should have sacrificed a goat before leaving. Good morning! Ah, Mistyos. How was Megaris? He's dead. Excellent. The full amount is promised. You expected me to haggle? Come now, Alexios. It isn't every day I have someone kill their own father. But he wasn't your real father, was he? Why did you send me to kill Nikolaus? Because I knew you could. Oh, why him? Because he was brilliant. He would have taken Athens in a month, two at most. And Stentor doesn't have the wolf's genius. Uh, you wanted to save Athens? There's no profit in a quick war. I know, I know. It's a lot to take in all at once. Come. <sighs> Tell me, Mistyos, did you learn anything worthwhile in your dealings with the wolf? He mentioned my birth father. He might still be alive. Not for long, if all goes according to plan. What do you mean? You're going to bring me his head, of course. 
Have you lost your mind? You killed the man who raised you for Drachmi. I merely assumed you wanted your family dead as much as I do. Malaka! You think you can play with me? I'll cut out your tongue! So disappointing. Investigate his house. Under who he wants in his slimy grasp now. This is a ship manifest. Elpinor selling weapons to both Athens and Sparta. He wants this war to go on forever. A letter to Elpinor. Oh, Phoebe. You led him right to me. I have met some treacherous people. None of them compare to Alpinor. I'm going to look under every rock, in every shadow, until I find and kill this vile serpent. I've never seen so many olive trees.
Time for a ride. This oracle gives better news than the one in Sparta. Alexios, isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpinon? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple builder. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. You weren't lying. It really is the spear of Leonidas. Uh, I may have mentioned you. I would appreciate you showing a bit more secrecy. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you, I, I thought you might get along. How did... It... One more move and the spear will be at your throat. Tell me your name. I also mentioned you can be a little defensive. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand a word of it, but that's why she's in there and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> you were on Kefalonia for too long. Delphi is nothing like they say. Has it always been like this? No. This was once an open and welcoming place. But war changes things. People seek out the Pythia for more political reasons. Prophecies in times of war often stir violent emotions. It's wise to keep your blades sheathed. Drawing blood in Delphi is considered an insult to Apollo. Punishment is severe. I have my own questions for the Pythia, but this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. 
<laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest? <laughs> All right. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line. Do I look like someone who waits in line? Enter into the light of Apollo. The light that illuminates shadow. Choose your question wisely, mortal. For you have but one. Speak, truth seeker! I lost my mother when I was young. I have to find her. Where is she? It's you! From the visions! The child on the mountain! How could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. There is wisdom in your decisions. Any other Mystios would have killed those people in that cave in Megaris. But you held back for the truth and balanced judgment with their lives. But how? No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain, the cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. Cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken! The prophecy is yours! You never answered my question! The Bithia is done for the day. I'm not leaving until I get answers! Rotatos, you're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She... knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you. She knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? Never mind. It's nothing. There are people in Phokis who can't be trusted, Alexius. But I'm not one of them. If you know something, you must act quickly. The Pythia's words control all our fates. She mentioned the cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? I'd heard whispers. A cult. Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia... This is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her when she's not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. I'll find where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required.
Mistios, well, aren't you a sight to my aged eyes? Young, energetic. Perhaps I should just pay for your body instead of your help. All things get better with age, don't they? Even you. The Oracle said that if I'm to live a long and happy life, I need to stay young at heart. But I mustn't lose focus. I need your help more than your magnificent body. I'm glad to hear it. Korigos, my husband, is having some difficulties keeping up with my hunger for pleasure. I imagine any man would. Oh, I have many lovers, but he's my soulmate. When we're together, it's indescribable. Then don't describe it. When we were younger, we would run into the moonlit forest, shed our clothes, and pleasure each other until sunrise. Our howls of ecstasy would echo throughout the valleys. By the gods, woman. I said spare me the details. I wasn't expecting a tough-looking mercenary to be so squeamish about a little fun. What does this have to do with me? I've learned of a powerful elixir, which if consumed will give someone the vigor and stamina of Eros. If you can gather me the ingredients, I can make it for my husband. All right, I'll find the ingredients, if you promise to keep your nocturnal activities to yourself. I have some drachmi, and Koragos has more. If you can bring me some bear scrotum and a deer tongue, I can make the elixir. Oh, is that all you need? Don't worry, I'll reward you well. I'm sure Koragos will be thankful also. Where can I find a bear near here? I heard there's a cave near the sanctuary that a large male bear has claimed. I'll be back with the ingredients soon. Yeah. 
Ella. The Oracle is hiding inside. I'll finally get some answers. Huh? Ella. <laughs> Hold up. That's a lot of protection for the Pythia.
Better stay hidden. Just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! I'm looking for my family. And everywhere I go, people are either lying or trying to kill me. You're the first person who might have some answers. But they'll kill me if I tell you. Not if I get to them first. Help me, and no harm will come to you. I promise. All right. But ask your questions quickly. The longer you're here, the more at risk we both are. What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles. I want names. I don't know. I swear, they hide behind masks and shrouds. Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So, all those prophecies from the gods, all those people, you're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived a terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure, but if he is, he would definitely have what you require. Any idea where I can find him? There is a fort just south of the Valley of the Nymph. He's been known to conduct business there. You've been helpful. May the light of Apollo guide you to your family. I should tell Herodotus what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. <laughs> 